commenting on the 2022 budget. Mm. Very ambitious budget. Right. Very, very nice budget to be true. Okay? Mm. Very nice budget to be true. First and foremost, the 2022 budget for Mr. Aka HM and the UPND mm. anchored on two ministries local government and education. Those are the ministries which uh, pres the, uh, Minister Mustombe uh, Komusogotwane uh, was anchored, though that is budget. He has given uh, constituency development funds 25.7 20, million mm. kwacha. Too good to be true. Be smiling, huh? Too good to be true. Yeah. Too good to be true. Too good to be true. With the economy of this country, which I know, too good to be true. Mm. He has also <coughs> uh, uh, promised that he's going to employ 30,000 teachers. Yeah. The teachers, they employed just two months. They haven't even been put on the payroll. They are waiting. They are still waiting. They are not on the payroll. And they have told us 30,000. First, if they, I don't know if it's 3,500 3, or so teachers who were recruited. They are not on the payroll because there's no money. Now they are giving us 30,000 teachers. Where are they going to get the money from? They were condemning us as PF. They were condemning us as PF. They were out there painting us black. No, these people, they are fond of borrowing. Okay? He was even measuring, you no, know, the ceiling, the breathing space is not there. If you borrow uh, 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 more than the borrowing which they have done, yeah. then you would have sold the country. That's what he said in his own words. So today, President Daka in the has sold us, all of us, I don't know when they are coming to pick us because we have been sold, all of us. That budget, it is too good to be true. We borrowed, if I'm not mistaken, first of all, Stumbeko <coughs> Musokotwane and MMD, they left a credit of $1.9 billion. That is the money which we inherited as PF when we were coming into power. We borrowed $11, million, $11 billion. And we were at $12.9 billion for the period of 10 years. $12.9 billion for the period of 10 years. Our budget is 172, 172 something, isn't it? And it is uh, that budget, 4 billion of that budget, it is going to CDF. If you calculate the percentage of the four billion, do you know how much money is going to be to, to CDF? Two percent. Two percent. Two percent. And in this two percent, that's where they have told us that we are giving you money. I want money to come to the constituencies. Very alarming. Very alarming statement, Mr. President. I am giving you money, a lot of money. They are going to construct roads in this same 20, 25.7 million, construct schools, uh, pay for, uh, for, 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 for parcels. Are you sure? For me, I was very okay with 1.6 million, which I was giving, I was getting from President uh, Edgar Chagualungu, because the rest of the things the central government was doing. I was very okay. Now 25.7 million. Now President Taka in the Ichirema, first of all, he wants to develop his constituencies. Okay? He wants to develop Wengwa. He wants to develop rural constituencies, his constituencies. In, in, well, what in, do you mean you say, when you say this is a constituencies? This is a deliberate so Those move. are people's constituencies, this, I it is a deliberate move. Hmm. It is a deliberate move to paint other constituencies black. The 25.7 million. What will be 25.7 million in Lusaka Central? It, was, it is nothing. 
Mulnari constituency, 25.7, it's nothing. In Kabushu constituency, the urban constituency, it is nothing. 25.7 million, it is nothing. It's better they give me 1.4 million kwacha, I do my drainages, and I do my few things, knowing very well that government will construct schools, government will construct roads, government will do other things at a central uh, at a central uh, point mm. today today my friend today they want to bring 25 uh, million 25.7 million at a constituency where i have no competent officers to administer that money let them uh, uh, come up, let them uh, put everything uh, at a district, uh, at a district, uh, uh, district level. Let the district commissioner uh, do the rest of uh, uh, the thing, mm. and let uh, let them continue with our 1.4, 1.6 million. Because are you trying to undermine, is, uh, honourable? Are you trying to undermine the the, the competence and uh, you know the potential me? of uh, some of your your your, your, no, I your don't, constituents? I don't short. have. You know, I don't have. I only yeah. have three workers have at you, my constituency office. Mm. Have you gone the back yet to find out? Uh, let me tell you. At, let me yeah, tell please. you. I have the secretary. Mm. I have uh, a security officer yeah. and an administrative officer. Three. Only three. Those are the, the, the those are my workers. Mm. Uh, the people I'm working with at the constituency office. And the, those they have no capacity to administer 25.7 million kwacha. Your constituency is big. Why can't you convene uh, an assembly with the, your people my friend, to get input? My people, you know, I will and just, to identify I will just with get input. I will just qualified. get it. I know my constituency. I know what my constituency would want to, to achieve mm. in terms of entrepreneur. I know. On that one, I know. Mm. There is no problem. But the people it's a new them. dimension, by the it way. It is not a new it's dimension. It's a new dimension. Oh. Other new dawn. It is not you a know, new dimension. This is, this is the things which we have you've been, been doing. You've been budgeting only 1.6 million kwacha, and now it, Bali is saying no. we are giving you it is wrong. a 25.7. It is wrong. It is wrong. Why can't you go back then, and freshen their minds? No. The 1.6 million kwacha, it was okay. I was uh, doing things according to the 1.7. 1.6 million kwacha mm. at a wide level. Okay? Now okay. they are giving me 27, 25.7 million kwacha. And they have told me construct roads, construct schools, give bursaries to your uh, to, to, to your people. Mm. And for me, that 25 million, I will give it everything to my people from grade 1 to the university because they are all deserving uh, 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 beneficiaries mm. because uh, they want to be educated so that money is nothing it's totally nothing mm. so this budget is too good to be true they are going to borrow they are going to borrow these guys they are borrowing uh, something like uh, 4.9 billion okay for consumption 4.9 billion for, for for consumption okay and this 4.9 billion by the end of five years they would have borrowed 50 billion 50 billion for consumption 50 billion for consumption because it will be uh, 24 uh, 24 point uh, 24.5 Okay, so if you get um, the, the two uh, 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 the creditors, it will come to 50, 50 plus billion. And I can assure you, these are the people who were on the top of the anti eels talking about borrowing. No, this is bad. This is bad. You can't uh, run government based on borrowed money. These people, they are, they are hypocrites. Hypocrites. This, they are hypocrites. That's why we are saying this budget is too good to be true. It Honorable. is too good to be true and I can assure you 
that the people of Zambia, let them first of all, let them not crap first, let them not be excited first, let them analyze this budget. Right. Let them analyze this budget and let them know that 49% of that total budget is borrowed, borrowed money. Borrowed money. And some of this money, maybe it is coming from uh, people advancing uh, very bad things in our country. After eating their money, they will come here that we are demanding gayism to come in our country. They won't refuse. They have already eaten their money. Mm. So let them, first of all, uh, realize and let this government tell us <laughs> where are they getting this money. That is one. The minister told us in parliament mm. that they are failing to pay salaries. They are failing to pay other government obligations. Oh, no, but we have money and in this country. Like we've been told. The before. minister, I mean, the minister himself, part of the, the minister, money, wait, you know, the minister himself told us. Former, you know, leaders, the minister, uh, for example, even the, 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 the investigation that was carried out by the police just a few weeks ago. Mm. Um, discovered no, huge those, sums of money in, in a home. Yeah, yeah, you are know, bringing not really commenting. Yeah, 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 we are We are bringing non issues here. Yes, but we are talking about real issues. Exactly. So, Mr. Piri, look I here. want to just fight that there is those money are in this issues. Those are non issues. There are a lot hmm. of people with money in their homes. A lot of businessmen and women with money in their homes. Hmm. More than that, four million kwacha which you are talking about, sixty-five million. Hmm. There are people with a lot of money. You saw the money which came out in, during Kaunda's time when he changed currency coming from people's homes big money not this uh, 65 million which you're talking about okay and we are talking about real issues here mm. we are talking about real issues to to change the lives of our people right. to change your children's future mm. okay the minister told us that he's failing to pay civil servants he's pay, failing to pay other government obligations okay our source of income, uh, Mr. P, our source of income is through ZRA. That is the biggest, the biggest uh, uh, source of income. Apart from ZRA, Nikukongola, you go and borrow. Mm. And us, we borrowed, yes. And the money which we borrowed in 10 years, mm. these guys, they want to borrow 5 billion, 5 billion in one year. Five billion dollars in one year. So we some wasana we 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 na piri mo musa we know this budget. Now we know we na na diya fefno fine bomb and the bulldozer na imini na muriya. I would have announced those uh, figures. Even President Ted Galung, mm. who would have told Minister Wariangando to go and announce the figures. These are just figures. They are just figures. What is critical is implementation. That is the critical part. Right. I can assure you, Mr. Piri, that this budget, mm. this budget, budget is too ambitious budget. And I can assure you that this budget is a risk to the people of Zambia mm. and to the UPND as a part. And, um, you know, now I'm going to say, I'm going to say, by UPND government, the size of no woman taken. Quabe in the field, quite a woman to a patikisha, 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 and some ado. Come with a be a woman if you have a error to letter a budget. President Jaka in the HM. Congratulations and congratulations to the UPND because they have just voted themselves out of government come 2026. Whether we like it or not, these guys are going. This budget is just a free campaign 